Partnering is critical to Pfizer's business. Our purpose is to bring innovative therapies to patients that make a meaningful and significant impact on their lives. In order for us to execute on that purpose, we need to work collaboratively with partners so that we can access their technologies, leverage our capabilities, and help to drive that innovation forward. On the science and technology side, we have particular interest in really breakthrough technologies. New approaches, for example, that enable our precision medicine efforts, that allow us new approaches to large or small molecule efforts, including our peptide and antibody approaches, or that enable new areas that we don't have the capabilities for internally but would like to get into. We're particularly interested in partnering opportunities that fall within our core areas. Those are cardiovascular metabolic, CNS, inflammation and immunology, oncology and vaccines. This is a very exciting collaboration for us, uh, focused principally on enabling biologics to be taken from intravenous infusions to subcutaneous administration. Our collaboration with Pfizer is based on discovery of, of therapeutic antibody candidates. I've been working with Pfizer to spin this drug candidate out into a new uh, independent company that we helped found and build a venture capital syndicate, bring in the CEO to really build a company around this one asset. Our partnership with Pfizer, which began last year, is really critical for both us and for the future of precision medicine from our perspective. Truly getting the right drug at the right dose to the right patient at the right time. I think if you would talk to the partners that we have worked with over the last few years, you'll see a tremendous change and you will hear there's a tremendous support uh, and recognition of what Pfizer can bring to the table. Simply starting with the business models we have applied to the type of interactions and input and value we have created for some of the biotech partners or the academic institutions speaks for itself. It's really impressed us about the relationship with Pfizer to date has been they're able to very effectively marry the advantages of a large corporation, obviously a global pharma company with very significant resources but also pair that with a very constructive attitude, very nimble attitude. The reason why our collaboration with Pfizer is so successful and so rewarding is that uh, we have a very collegial interaction, a very collegial collaboration with, uh, with Pfizer's team. On top of the breadth and depth that Pfizer brings on the commercial end and with the marketing reach and all that, they offer uh, a lot of support in the, in the CMC and the regulatory areas and with a, a mid-stage clinical trial that type of support can be invaluable. What makes it attractive for Oregon Health and Science University is the quality of science. Science is what drives any, any projects in Pfizer and that has been the centerpiece here. Our philosophy in terms of structuring transaction is find the most um, appropriate structure for the needs of our partners as well as our needs. So from a certain perspective, we're structure agnostic. This started off as an R&D collaboration focused on precision medicine. We also were introduced to the Pfizer Venture arm and they've been instrumental because they've actually participated in our early financing rounds and helped drive the company to the next level. I don't think there's one partner of choice in the industry. I think the partnering relationship is, is exactly that. It's a relationship. I think you know, as a company, certainly we'd all love to be the partner of choice, but really, in a specific conversation, I want to be the partner of that partner's choice.